So today I have for you a good old build. This may not be the absolute 100% best build, but it's the best Stasis Titan build I have found as of today. So first, I guess we should go over the aspects. The aspects I am going to be using is Tectonic Harvest and Diamond Lance. When paired with Cadmus Ridge Lance Cab, the Diamond Lances will spawn crystals. And then also, they will throw more crystals down when getting direct impacts on bosses or vehicles, which creates even more damage for your Diamond Lances. And then, getting a Rally Barricade can have you a more reliable and safer chance to get said Diamond Lances. So, you are going to be doing around 40k, 40K free damage for absolutely nothing. This around in Grandmaster Nightfalls. And that is not bad. And it also works on champions as well. But this is what we're going to be using. We're going to be using Whisper of Rendering so we can break those crystals easily. Because the amount of crystals we are going to be making is going to be absolutely ridiculous. Because Diamond Lances can be created every six seconds. And we're going to have this so we can have more grenade recharge. So our grenade can give us Diamond Lances as well. And since they did reduce the cooldown, the base cooldown of Glacier Nades recently, we are going to be able to use these a lot more often with the Whisper of Shards. Whisper of Fissures to make sure that they do even more damage. So, and also Whisper of Chains. So you can just use the Diamond Lance as defense if you need to. Sit behind your Rally Barricade, throw the crystal behind you or something like that, and you will be good. You'll have the increased resilience and damage reduction behind a Rally Barricade. I'm pretty sure anyways. It feels, it feels like it. It feels like you're invincible behind the Rally Barricade. Sometimes. And then we're going to have Stasis Shards track towards your position. Because what you want to do is stay mobile. So you really don't want to chase these down too much. Because you're just going to be walking in straight lines here and there. I'd rather be collected in a 20 meter radius around me. And the exotic we're going to be pairing this with is Wicked Implement. Because while standing behind the Rally Barricade, rapid hits, be targets become slowed. After hitting like three or four shots, you'll start applying slow every two. And that can freeze. And then... When destroying Stasis Crystals or Stasis Shards, it refills and overflows a magazine with the Catalyst. And also, the Catalyst has Headstone on it. So, you're going to be getting more Stasis Crystals there, too. And, I think, where it feels like it, the Headstone for Wicked Implement does a little more damage. I don't know if that's correct. Maybe because exotic Headstone thing, I don't know. But if feels like this does more damage, from what I've noticed, than other headstone weapons like Is Luna and, well, Versace D. And I'm going to be pairing this with the best indebted kindness I have. Sadly, this is the best I have. Wish I had Volt Shot, that would have been a lot better. And then you can either use this to get your anti-barrier or rapid hits, or a different solar machine gun. Because you want those rapid hits, solar rapid hits, to give you anti-barrier if you're planning to deal with overload, with slow, and unstoppable with breaking up or shattering. But if you're looking for damage for like a dungeon or a strike, you can use fire and forget. So, you can use harmonic scavenger, and then have the current mod set up I do. Which I have recuperation, because you're going to be creating orbs with Stasis Siphon. And Stasis Siphon, it works on Shattering Crystals. So, you're going to be making a lot of orbs if you're killing stuff with the Stasis weapon Wicked Implement. I have done several GMs with this build that I will show you the peaks of those GMs with this build. It doesn't make you an absolute god immortal. If you added rhyme, it maybe could have. 
but having the more power fantasy of just running around, throwing diamond lances, and just freezing everything that comes in your way. I just love that a lot more than just, oh, I need to heal. Let me throw down my diamond lance. No, I want to go full offense. And here, I'll show the mod setup I have. So you can replicate. We also have one firepower, because you're mainly going to be shattering them with your weapons, so you're most likely going to get this off. So, yeah. And you can change out this void one for a solar one. The only reason I had void is because I was doing something different in a Grandmaster. It was just double void damage, so I was just like, eh. And then powerful attraction, just so you can get them. Just in case if your teammates also spawn some as well, that will power your stasis weapon surge and create more headstone because you're going to get more precision kills of this. The greatest. I had like 300 kills while they barely had 100. The Scorn have overrun the worm breeding grounds once again. Are you nearby? We are. Handling it now. And that's why I love this super. Why are y'all standing in the center? Spawned in order for me. Well, thanks to his invis, we can move on, but I think we should still kill all these invis.
And I can hardly see any part of them. You know, he's getting all the credit for the stuns. I don't know what that chieftain. And there he goes. If they were both together, I would have killed them both. Why are they floor screams? Okay, I got it. I got it. Yeah. That was a good call by teammate to do the invis. This is so good. Alright, teammate, you should be fine staying there. my super again. Oh, 
Bruh! Take one diamond lance. Don't take one diamond lance. Yes. Making sure these bosses can't move. This is just great. For these champions, I mean, mm -hmm. same difference. Alright, here is where Cadmus Ridge comes into major play. It has been coming into play by spawning crystals for diamond lances. Oh, there's one right there on him. Hold on. Oh, help! Not 17 minutes, but it's getting really close there. We are basically running through this fast. And we have like almost max revives. Actually, are they there? Okay. I was making sure, damn it. Good. <laughs> well, Radiance is about to run out. They probably don't know that for right now.
Back up. Where's the Stark Nova guy doing? You ain't scared. You wanna be? Cheap and just sucking the bosses bulge. Pretty much. 